What up, Loyalty Squad? It's your girl, Fonz. And as you guys can tell by the title, I am back with another hair video. Back, back with another hair video. Back, hey, baby. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey y'all. This is um, day five. I am here to talk about day three and four and today. So if you're new here, hit that support button. Also remember to turn on your notifications to be notified when I upload. And if you're not new here, welcome back. I love you. I love you. <laughs> now, without further ado, let's get to the video. Okay, guys, I have been, let me come a little closer. I have been researching a lot of natural um, ways to take care of your hair. As y'all can see, my hair is like real dry right now. I did things a little different with my rice water. As y'all know, I'm <laughs> testing, testing the water. Rice water, that is. Um, <laughs> so, it's okay. This is different, you guys. Yes, this is rice water. <laughs> I know most of y'all gonna be like, what, the, what is that? Okay, this, I put oil in the water. As you guys know, um, oil rises. This is um, the fruit from the banana. And this is the nutrients, the micronutrients from um, the rice. Now, um, what I did was, <sighs> what I did was I um, boiled my rice and I let it sit in this jar for about a week. To stop the fermentation process, you can refrigerate your, raw, your, your water and that's what I did with this one because I already had rice water which was the pineapple rice water that I had um, I want to say on day one and two so I finished that so I took this out after I took this out I let it sit out for a day I put an extra banana peeling in here and I let it sit for a day and then um, I'm just now opening it today and it smells so good <laughs> no, but it really did smell good. But I added, like I said, I added oil. And this time, to my spray bottle, I added apple cider vinegar. I actually used some of this on my daughter's hair because I just gave her a bath and did her hair wash, her stuff. Yeah. And I used this on her hair. Um, now, I, I want to tell you guys why it's brown. Cause I know y'all like, okay, did you just skip past that? Like, why, why does it look like that? Um, <laughs> um, the reason why it's brown is because you know how when uh, bananas start to turn brown, that's why my rice water is brown. I let the, um, like I said, I did it twice. The first time I let the banana sit in the water as it fermented, took it out. I then put it in the refrigerator to uh, stop the fermentation process. After I took it out, once I was getting ready to use it, I put another banana peeling in and let it sit for a day. That's why it turned brown. There's nothing wrong with it. And you know what? It's funny because most people think, and I was one of those people, that the brown part of the banana is bad. It's really not unless it gets like too brown, I guess. But um the bananas were fresh and um sitting in this water it actually made it turn colors faster so yeah now like i told you guys i have apple cider vinegar in this water here and what i'm going to be doing today because i want to y'all know i want to stop dyeing my hair so i'm going black today yeah you're not supposed to leave um, 
apple cider vinegar in your hair and I normally leave my rice water in my hair all day um, sometimes for three days I'll leave it in and I'll end up rinsing it out and then applying more each day I'm on this rice water challenge so today I will not be leaving the rice water in my hair um, what I did was I spritzed it after I got out of the shower I um, spritzed my hair real good massaged my scalp and I let it go um, all day to the next day day three and four I pretty much did the same thing I just you know um, rinsed my hair out spritzed it with the rice water massaged my scalp and let it go and then I oiled my hair of course afterwards I oiled, uh, I oiled my hair with my oil but yeah let me stop talking y'all because I can get the rambling and all that um if I forget anything I'll you know put my little bullet points up and stuff so let's go ahead and get this process done over I love rice water you can make rice I look I said I was gonna let's I said I said I said let's go and I'm still talking but you can make rice water in so many different ways it is just amazing the benefits of rice water like I knew you can drink rice water I knew you can you know wash up with it I'm gonna actually start making my own shampoo which is coming up in the next video so make sure y'all stay tuned for that oh <laughs> I love it I love rice water I love rice water so much. It just seems like when it settles, you be looking at it like, oh, what is that? But I promise you it smells so good. Oh my God. Now with regular rice water, I would not be able to do that. Like rice water without like a banana or orange or <laughs> oil. I wouldn't be able to do it at all. But yes, you guys, look, it's starting to separate now. Let's go ahead and get to this this video. I don't think I'm gonna be. A, I'm not. I don't think I'm gonna use all of this. So I'll let you guys know the benefits of apple cider vinegar throughout the video. So here we go. This little box come with some gloves. I thought that was real cute. How they put it in there? Cause normally y'all know that it's stuck to like when you get <laughs> y'all know it's normally the well. Yeah, and most of the ones that I've gotten, they normally stuck to the actual paper. But these came in a little bag, I thought that was cute. And they black. I hate the one, the, the clear plastic gloves. I don't know why, they just look nasty. Cause sometimes I reuse mine. And, see my head. <laughs> but yeah, I'm about to put some Vaseline around the perimeter of my head, you know what? <laughs> Let's get to this video. Because I don't know if this is turning black. Like, I don't know. Who oh, it did turn black? It smell good. It didn't turn that black, so I'm wondering. Look, y'all. Y'all see that? It look black, but it don't look as black. I'm gonna shake it a little bit more, then I'm gonna come back on. Y'all, as soon as I said I was getting off, it started turning like this. It turned fast as hell. I don't even know if I need some more in the back. I didn't even look at it. It's like as soon as I cut, literally, as soon as I cut up the camera, I look at the mirror and I'm like, oh my God, it's really turning it. Like right now. Plus my hair is so short, so. Yeah. <laughs> I have to get some liners to straighten me up back there. But I'm loving this black, y'all. I really am. 
But I did want to let you guys know that after I wash my hair, well, it's gonna, I'm just going to condition my hair. I am actually going to be adding my rice sweater. So that is a part of the video today for my 30 day rice water challenge. Yes. Boom. But yes, I am going to rinse this out my hair. I left it on for 30, 30 to 35 minutes. Um, and once I rinse it out, get it done. I'll come back to talk to y'all in a minute. Okay, loves. I just got out the shower. I am about to um, dry my hair off with my shirt. Um, I actually rinsed out the rice water with the ACV in it because it's not good to leave apple cider vinegar in your hair. Um, so I just let it, you know, sit on there for like 20 minutes, 20 to 30 minutes. And um, at night, I am going to actually spritz my hair, like mix my hair with um, my regular rice water and let it dry and then, you know, go about my day. Well, go about my night. <laughs> So that's what I'm about to do. Nothing really spectacular. Oh, and I'm also going to seal my hair with my oil that I made. Um, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment box below and I will be glad to get back to you. Talk to me, I talk back. I talk back, boo boo. <laughs> Let me know if you enjoyed this video. Um, I don't know, I'm feeling this black, y'all. Like I really am. I'm about to go ahead and dry my hair. And if there's anything else that I missed, I will come back. Well, I will leave it at the end of this video. That's about it. That's about it. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next vlog, challenge, review, or whatever it is that you watch. Take care, love. Damn.